Hey folks, Starman Jude here with another episode of The Long Dark, Survival 758. So the last one, we uh, made our way out of the Forlorn Muskeg and um, into Mystery Lake. We are going to eventually make our way to uh, Ash Canyon to try to get the technical backpack before we move on to other things. But looting as we go... And just trying to uh, set up a base here. I dropped off some books. I uh, was going to read it, but it's a little too dark. Because um, I was going to clean my gun. I think I'm just going to read the rest of this here. Just to get these book stuff out of the way. Um, I may even... This looks like the revolver is going to be level 2 now. Groovy. And now I can drop this book. Alright, so we're going to probably put the used ones... Fnaw. And I think the next one on my list will be this guy. Uh, Frontier Shooting, I didn't... See, reprint that's a rifle firearms. Okay, so we're going to read this first. Hopefully we can find more of these books because they will come in handy. Uh, the other thing I think I'll end up doing here because I have read already, so we'll just do three. We'll just polish this one off just for... Just for good measure. Um, looks like... And then we can drop this one too. I don't quite think it is... Put there. There. Uh, ooh, we don't have a lot of water. So, we'll have to... Surrounded by snow and nothing to drink. Relax, Astrid. We're fine. Uh, what, what I will do is... Let's start up a fire. Because every bit helps to increase this one. Um, I think, if I recall right... Okay, that that is not what I wanted to do. It'll be actually kind of good when I get rid of these cardboard ones. I mean, I could drop them, but you know what? I might as well use Come them on. for these stupid fires. <laughs> I know they decrease your chances of actually successfully lighting a fire. But... I don't know. I mean, I guess I could use them for, like, torches or something, but... Yeah, no. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do here is... Well, let's throw on that. I need to go downstairs and grab some more wood so I can throw that on and start... I will grab a coal, I guess, right? Um, uh, nope. Uh, reclaim wood? Sure, sure. Sure. Okay, well, whatever. We'll... <laughs> I actually should probably not use reclaimed wood, so, because if I want to, mm, there we go. Let's bounce it over here. I actually want to drop, like, all of them. There we go. Okay, let's head back upstairs here rather quickly. So I don't want this fire going out. I don't think it will. Oh, 33 minutes, that's fine. It's fine. I'll we'll throw that on for good measure. Okay. And what up? Let's cook that up. All right. Now, we're going to go outside real quick because we haven't mapped this location. But first, let's... Uh, I feel a little dry mouth coming on, so we're going to drink a soda really quick here. And outside. It's later in the afternoon. Eh... Might. Hmm. Okay. I think it might be a good idea. I mean, we can search down here for some uh, cattails, because we know there are some, like, right here. Ah. This is the actual mystery lake, yes? Is that what? Well, okay. Well, whatever. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that might have been it. I actually kind of want to see. Honestly. Ah, uh, mystery lake. Whoops. Let's, uh... Mm, okay, so maybe not... Hmm, that might be a tricky one to do, so... Anyway, let's, uh... 
Is it the only cat's tail like fucking for us? Uh, let's see, maybe. Well, maybe it is. Okay, well, let's head out to uh, the fishing huts out here. Actually, yeah, I mean, we'll, <laughs> we'll make our way there. Um, the lookout will head up there. Actually, that's not a bad place to go after we check this out before it gets too dark. Um, we don't need to climb it. There is a much easier way around. Uh, I mean, it's, it's, sure, it might be faster to just go up the creek there and climb the rope, but, you know, uh, to save energy, well, to save energy, it's probably best to just go up and around. I mean, it's, you know, <laughs> you actually probably get there in just amount, same, same amount of time, in my opinion. And it's easier not to exert your energy when you kind of need it. Let's see. Uh, there should be a deer carcass up there, too. So we'll head up that way after we're done looking at this spot here. And it looks like dog food. That's cool. A hatchet. Oh, lucky day. Well, maybe, but, um, you know, and I'll, I already have one. Okay, so here's what we'll do. We'll take it with us. Uh, I thought that was something there. Mm, okay, nothing there. There should be a tackle hidden here somewhere. I don't need the can, my goodness. Actually, I'll probably take it with me. Yeah, let's take the can because when we get the noisemaker, well, we'll have that at our disposal. Really? There really wasn't much in there. That was a little disappointing. Okay. We are going to head back this way and we're going to go on up to the overlook. Maybe. Maybe. Actually, you know what? We, we may not. We may actually wait until we find the Polaroid. So let's actually come around this way. Because I, yeah, I kind of want to find the Polaroid first. And then we hit the Vista. And it'll survey a whole swath of area. So let's come over here. I'm unsure. I'm trying to, I'm waiting to see for, waiting for the prompt. And I know there's wolves over here, but uh, they're probably over towards the cabins, which is okay. I don't mind. That looks like a deer. I hear clanking. Actually, I'm going to step in here really quick and do this. Okay, cool. I would drink almost anything about now. Okay, relax, Astrid. Man, we're getting a ton. Ooh, nice. We're getting a ton of marine flares. Excellent. Another gunsmithing book. I will use that. I'll need it because, um, you know, I want to get that to level five. Mm, we'll take it. Probably tear it down. I'll right, we'll check the chips. All right, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, okay, cool, 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 cool. Next. Okay, the wolves are over there. Yep, deer over here. This is this is okay. We'll hit these. Are all three of those wolves? I would say so. So it looks like we got deer over here. Deer over her. Yeah, don't do that again. <laughs> yeah, let's not do that again. That was ick. Wait a second. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I, I left the water running. I left the water running. <laughs> um, I'll bet it boiled dry. I bet it boiled dry and my fire went out because... Um, shoot. I was only meaning to run outside and draw the map, which took 20 minutes, and if I did it three times, then I'm at an hour. So I need to kind of hightail it back. Let's hightail it back. I, I, mm, nope, we're, we'll have to come back for this. Uh, I know I can just, you know, start it up again, but oh my god, that would just be annoying. I'd be, what a waste. Like, seriously, like, I put two logs on for the purpose of trying to, you know, get water, and, well, um, man, did I fail miserably. <laughs> so hopefully it hasn't boiled away. 
because I put a full two liters on, right? And if it takes an hour to melt it and another, what, like 55 minutes or so to boil, and then I think it gives you like an hour grace period. So we might be okay as long as I get back uh, very soon. Yeah, so I did three times, right? One, two, yeah. Yeah, so I, I kind of need to... Uh, I need to get back pronto. We'll come back and look at this stuff. I can't believe I did that. I mean, if anything, I should have just gone outside, gotten the cabin, and then gone back inside and rode for an hour. <sighs> Man. Squirrel. Seriously. A squirrel mind going on right now. <laughs> All right. Well. Here's the open, it's, it's there, and if not, then, well, I wasted a trip back. Had I done, I think if I had done another survey, I might have just cut my losses and just said, well, since we're out here, we'll just keep going, but now hopefully I can make it back in time. I'm still try to book it here. I'm, I am still a little over encumbered. I'm kind of curious, kind of curious what I'm carrying. That's a little much. There we go. Almost there. And Lake Trail. Okay, so there's the look at. We'll eventually make our way there, but apparently we'll do it today. So much for my plans for, uh, you know, going, <laughs> going to the lookout. Oh no, no, no! I was, I was waiting on the lookout to, uh, for the Polaroid. I was gonna look for the Polaroid. Okay, let's hurry. Come on, come on, come on! Upstairs, let's go. Like, I left the stove on before I left the house. Oh, 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 oh. It's, it's there. It's good. Oh. Okay. Whew. That was a close one. Yes, can. Let's put this down. Because we found it, and we'll cook it. Oh, wait a second. Hold up. How much time we got left on this? Oh, we're down at embers. I think I can throw a couple sticks on. Eh, yeah, okay. Eh, just for good measure, I may just throw another stick on. That's fine. Dang, okay. Oh yeah, uh, let's uh, drop the hatchet because I don't need both of them. Um, got that stuff there. I don't need both of those. Let's, uh, I may have to go downstairs for some stuff, but let's... Okay. How oh, yeah, am I doing on food here? Uh... Well, we'll wait to eat that because that'll make me sick. I have, I'll get the food poisoning and... But I have to make sure that I have... Do I have antibiotics? I've got the Rishi tea. Hmm. Eh, that might work. Okay, we have scrap metal. Okay, let's drop all of the marine flares. And we got the cans here. So let's drop two of those. And that one off of here. Yeah. I already looked at this stuff, didn't I? Well, I mean, yes and no. I know this is a sack of potatoes, which I'll leave in there because, honestly, mm, it's not that spectacular. I, I don't, first of all, I don't want to be carrying around potatoes that, you know, uh, unless I'm doing something special with them. Speaking of something special, uh, let's see, level two cooking. So what can I do? I need cooking oil and acorn bannock. So that's only two seconds. That's like the same as like a granola bar or something, right? Not a whole lot there. Um, ground. Oh, those are acorn pancakes. Eh. Okay, so I have the mill flour, which I'll actually drop. That might be what's kind of weighing me down. Hmm. 
We'll set that there. Yep. We will do that uh, right now, as a matter of fact. Oh, I forgot. I need to make coffee. And we'll drop this, too. I really don't need that. Okay. Uh, no, fl no flour. It's going to go right there. And this will go here, even though it's not... I mean, what? That's... <laughs> 0.1 kilograms, so, you know, it's not really, what was I doing? Oh, yeah. I need to make coffee. And since it is dark, hmm. Hmm, budge. Well, okay, so we'll have to, yeah. <laughs> we will have to... Let's take the charcoal here and put it away. Oh, yeah, that's right. I have another pot. Sweet. I forgot about that. Wait, where the hell did I get the second? Oh, downstairs, and then the other one was... Mm, I can't remember. Where did I find the other pot? In Trevor's cabin? Maybe. At any rate. Why don't we make up all the coffee so there would be ten of them? Um, you know what? I, ooh, hmm, well, I have one now, well, because we'll need it, so let's just, well, it doesn't hurt to light more fires, so we'll put it like that, because we're going to need to up that skill anyway, and, you know, it's like I read Come the on, book, but Come it on. wasn't enough to even get me to level two, so I still need to make some fires in order to get there. I think in total to get to level five, you have to have something like, what, 250 fires or something like that? It's something that can be cheese oh there it is all right uh well how much water do i actually have so if i got 10 i need to take 0.2 so i need like i should probably make let's see how this fares <laughs> I'll just uh, spam make coffee. Might as well. Well, let's do that. And that. Turn to coffee. And that's it. Oh, I am starving. Ooh. Uh, let's eat those for the... right now. Because we'll need the dog food. Uh, do I not have enough water? I don't have enough water. Okay, so yeah, that's that would be why. Okay, go ahead and get that going. We'll add... Mm, let's add fuel. Uh, what I, I think I'll end up doing here... Yeah, let's light this up. I mean, it really isn't going to hurt me if I have this lit. I have plenty. We'll take a look. I have plenty of fuel. And I got a jerry can downstairs here, and then I got another one at Trapper's Cabin, which will be helpful. Ah, fir wood. That's a good good way to go. Um, I think that was it. Okay. Getting tired. I'm like, yeah, I'm tired, which is good. So... Yeah, yeah, I'll just yeah, make this as we go, I guess. I mean, if I really need to, then... Ah, okay. Let's put it out. Fur. There we go. Cool. Um, so while we're at it, let's look at... Oh, the gunsmithing book. Forgot about that. Uh, we'll want to wait on this, so... So if anything, I'm going to want to probably drop it and put it there. Probably re... Mm, I mean, I guess it wouldn't hurt if I read any of these books. On the other hand, I could always... I mean, I could always, uh, you know, fix some clothes, maybe? Just put that there for that, so... We're good there. Um, yeah, whoop, put it out. 
Oh, hmm. Let's see, those are fine. These muck locks, I mean, these are decent work boots, but I'm actually gonna drop those. My goodness, I didn't realize I was still hauling those stupid things around. <laughs> We're gonna drop that and we'll drop that. We kind of need to offload some weight. These are work pants. Snow pants are better. Combat pants are still better. So why don't we do this? Let's harvest this guy. Okay. And definitely harvest this guy. I don't need a t-shirt. Do one minute still boiled? Let's do this. Let's go ahead and eat this. I know I'm gonna be sick, but I'll make the Rishi tea warm it up. <sighs> I'll just bite the bullet, because we'll need to sleep like 12 hours or something like that. Hey, all right, nope, didn't get sick. Excellent. There's good news. I know it's only like a chance of it, but still, uh, you know, I would rather not. Um, I wonder if, what kind of, what do I get off of this? Cured leather, it takes 10 minutes. Fine. Whoops, and back it up. Do I need tomato soup? Half hour till boiled, all right. So, now we got, let's action that. So at least we get some more cured leather. I mean, yeah, I'll need it for the mucklucks, which is probably what's gonna end up being. That's uh, 95, 77. Let's do a repair on the hat. I know I'm gonna I'd probably find a better hat here in a, not too long, but you know, in all honesty, if I can repair whatever, I'm gonna repair whatever. How are we looking? 30 minutes to boil dry. All right. We'll just drink this. Okay, now. Cook you. Yep. I need to add something. Hopefully this is uh, near completion. Oh, it is done. Okay, cool. That was the last one. Excellent. Um, let's actually do this and this one, right? Yep. Yep. Fabulous. Cool. All right. Now, let's, uh, well, okay. Sleep for like 12 hours, right? Or however long until I wake up, right? I, mean, it's, I think it wakes you up when you're fully rested. So whenever that happens. All right, cool. And we can, we're gonna drink a soda. I think what I'm gonna do is go up to, okay, cool. Hey, and now I can move a lot better. Much more better. <laughs> Hopefully it's not windy. <laughs> Hopefully it's not windy, he says. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, it's a little more than that. Um, okay, so uh, I guess we're gonna have to... Uh, I was hoping to go to the lookout. No, I wasn't. I was hoping to go back down the trail. Hmm, I think I might just end up not doing that at all. At least until it passes. Um, now I'm debating whether I want, hmm, because I, newspaper, tinder plugs, yeah, so we need to make, we'll do some of this, hopefully it'll, uh, kind of, once I get done with making this stuff, it'll be over, and then we'll just, off do a thing. It actually sounds like it's done. 
I mean, I'm not hearing any rattling. Yep, just like that. Okay. <laughs> cool. You know what? We'll just go to the lookout. Why not? Um, because, honestly, it could be the watchtower that's the point. I can't remember. Maybe the lookout tower is the point in Coastal Highway. Here, it's, it's the overlook here. But this should be fine. There's a few rabbits up here I can get. I think there's a deer carcass I can cut up. Um, Cause we'll we'll need the we'll need to get the meat. Um, you know that's. <laughs> I can't be, I'm like barely hanging on with food. It's it's kind of crazy how little food I found. Um, and maybe that's one of the parts of the update, I guess. I mean, the food is a lot more scarce than previously. Because I remember, you know, it's like you could get food and, you know, pretty good abundance um, before. So we'll see what we can do here. Yeah, we'll wait till we get to a level five to yeah, let me grab a let me just grab a stick. It's a webbit. Hello, webbit. Whoa, where are you going, bunny? Nah, nobody wants to play with me. All right, let's check this out. I know there's a memento cache here, so obviously we're going to have to come back. Sweet. Cool. All right. Fine. What do you got, man? Go juice. And sticks and a stick and a log. Yep, memento cache is here. I believe the key is in the truck by the dam. Or is it... I can drop any of this gear. I'm trying to think where it is. I can't remember, to be honest with you. Yeah, I can't really remember. Hmm. Okay. Uh, I'm sure I'll come across it. I'm not terribly I'm worried. For a drink right now. Ooh, ptarmigans. Hmm. Can I hit these guys? Has anybody actually caught them? I mean, can I, can I hit one? Oh man, that was uh, pathetic. Well, we have to cut that up. Should I take the guts for good measure? Let's take the guts for good measure. This will take me an hour to do. This may be okay or not. Oh, come on, I need food. Okay, I smell. Yes, I know, I'm thirsty. Let's drink a coffee. I mean, I can always save the coffees, but I mean, you know. Okay, Lake Overlook uh, nah. knocked off, if you will. We're not going to take the height off that deer. I don't need it quite yet, but let's find, let's grab, gather the uh, crow feathers. I don't need to come back up here for, because it's going to deteriorate now that I've interacted with it. So we'll just let it in. I, could eat anything right now. I know, Astrid. Maybe I'll go in this cave and cook up that deer. We gather some sticks. Why don't we do that? Just to just so she, just so my lady like hushes. We'll cook for ya. Okay, there's a the rabbit. There's the rabbit. 
There's the rabbit. What is going on? Well, I need the stones. I threw both of them. And honestly, I don't want to shoot it because that would be kind of dumb. Maybe it's like, like that. Well, I'm close. Darn it. I think you can run up and cat just catch them, but uh, I think, uh, well, let's just cook this meat. We're <laughs> I may have to make some snares since I had the guts, and we'll let them cure, and then have the reclaimed wood, so why don't we just do that? We'll cook this deer up. Um, hopefully I have enough sticks in order to cook a kilo and a half. Or almost two kilos. Hmm. Oh, wait, yeah, I've got sticks, and there's uh, the wood that I picked up. So we're good. Okay. Ah, we only need one. Okay, cool. All right. I don't know how much charcoal I have. Let's... 21? Eh, okay, all right. That always helps to pick some up. Why not? Uh, 90%? Cool. We'll take it. Thanks, friend. We're using your fire. Come on, little fire. As long as it lights. Which it looks like it's about to, so we're good. All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. Oh, yeah, don't you know? Okay. Whoa. Okay, okay. Throw that down. It's gonna take an hour. This should be fine. All the way at the end, all the way, all the way, all the way, all the way. All the way. Cool. Yummy. Mmm. How am I doing on water? Well, okay. I probably could use some. I mean, I know I can, I'm going to grab some toilets and stuff, but I kind of need some a little sooner than, than the dam. Because, yeah. I kind of need to keep moving, so I should probably... Yeah, I should probably kind of just be done kind of hanging around here a little too long. Um, so let's do this. Why don't we just wait till that's done here. Let's eat this. This place. Getting a bit thirsty. Yep, I know. Let's add some sticks. That'll be fine. I'm not terribly worried about um, the thirst bit. I mean, yeah, it's going to be annoying, but uh, same time. Well, I mean, I guess I could drink this. It's not going to. Okay, so I got about another. Yeah, so we'll definitely need some. Okay, let's just speed this up because. Let's pick that up and pick that up. Sure I carry much more. Well, dude! Man, I almost, pff, that would have been silly. Oh my goodness. All right. And let's uh, grab a torch. Let's get my inventory really quick because. Yeah, okay. Okay, so that, that's done then. All right, fair enough. Okay, I'm gonna try my hand again at this. <laughs> because the bunny's right there. How did I miss that? And how did I miss that? Like, it just went sailing past him like a... Don't go rolling off. Did you just jump down the cliff, bunny? Nope, you didn't. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Fine, fine, fine. We'll head back and drop off my loot. And then I think we'll uh, take off. Because we have to, we have a little bit ways to go before we hit Ash Cannon. And um, uh, I 
Hey, I mean, I can loot as I go, but I really want that technical backpack. And I mean, I can stop when I need to, because um, I know I'm going to be stopping at the farmhouse in Pleasant Valley. Um, yeah. So it is my goal is to hit Ash Canyon, but uh, obviously, I mean, what day am I on? I'm on <laughs> first week and I haven't made it there yet. Uh, I've been here in this region for, I don't know, a few days anyway, right? So let's just, uh, well, yeah, we'll, we'll need to drop off the guts. Not gonna make any snares now. <clears throat> and I probably won't. Yeah. I guess I don't need to have the rifle. It might actually be a little cumbersome to have it. So let's do this. We're gonna drop those uh, guts. And that's fine. Hmm, debating on... Hmm. Well, I don't need that or that. Ooh, I don't need that, so let's leave that here. <laughs> that was kind of a weight off my shoulders. I wonder if I can... What do I need to repair? The scrap metal. Okay, well, let's uh, pick up one of the scrap metals and do a quick repair. Oh. Okay. I don't know if how much of a waste it is, like... But let's just do a quick repair on this. Why not? Did that seriously fail? Okay, you know what? <sighs> Drop it. <laughs> fine. We'll take it with me, and then that should be fine. Okay, we don't need... That oh we got this book but we're going to drop that as well and we'll uh, take it upstairs and add it to the uh, reading collection. There we go. Cool. So it'll make us come back here so I can read. Anything else that I need to drop while I'm sitting here thinking about it? We're looking at it. Got lots of coffee, so it sh that'll come in handy in Ash Canyon. I know this. Um, I just had to make sure I continue to pack light. Um, we probably only need one of the teas, so let's drop that and drop that. Mm, this should be okay. Still waiting on for better clothing. I think that's okay. I think we're good here. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, I want to take as much of the... Uh... Okay, on we go. This is a good time as any to head on out. So, uh, we'll we'll come back and... I say that. I'm sitting there staring at the lookout tower, and I'm like, well, I know potentially there's a rifle up there. Maybe a distress pistol. The distress pistol will help against the bears. Should I come across one? Because it says the revolver will not. The revolver won't do anything but piss it off. <laughs> so I think I will uh, would rather have that at my disposal uh, if I have to use it. Besides, it's lighter than than a rifle, and. If I get a rifle, I'm going to have to bring it back. Or I should say, wherever I find it, because I'm headed out to Ash Canyon, is leave it and then pick it up on the way back. Because I want to read those books before I actually, you know, do anything. Um, I only have three rounds in with me anyway. Um, so let's just... Uh, yeah, why don't we just head up there? Just for good measure and then we will go to them we'll do some looting there but I mean we're not gonna go extensively looking through through the place 
uh, not yet anyway. Uh, you know, it's like we'll kind of just hit some of the hot spots that are there and then uh, if we can pick up some items, uh, maybe a better hat or, you know, maybe some like ear warmers. I'm not sure actually where those things spawn anyway. So I've always just been lucky to come across them. So I don't really remember where I find them. So we'll see. Uh, the other, yeah, some better clothes is what I'm looking for. I don't think there's a rifle there. Um, I know I can find a knife in the dam, but I have two already, so that's not necessary. So I won't even hit that lower dam too much. I'll pretty much just go out that door and, um, and keep on going. But first, to the top of the lookout. Pretty sure, yeah, I can, I can make the dam before nightfall. I mean, I'll have to use the lantern in there anyway, because it's dark. I may have to start up another another small run that's just to see if, uh, how long can I go with certain certain things like I know people have done one where it's like how long can you go without a fire uh, that one seems a little silly to me because well you really can't go without a fire at all um, sure you can probably bounce from place to place trying to find water but um, you know you're not going to survive too long okay cool you're not gonna survive too long because i mean you're eventually gonna need to cook meat and so you know it's like uh but i mean i'm talking like what if i had you know if i did like summer in canada something like that where i just wear nothing but shorts or you know i wear the t-shirt the and shorts <laughs> okay the wind's picking up Ooh, nice. Ooh, it's a book. All right. Pinnacle peaches, salt book. I, ooh, hey, look at this. Cooking skillet, we'll put you there. Well, I see the flares, but is there a flare? Mm-hmm, okay. Spray paint, don't need, that's fine. No rifle. Bandage, energy bar, excellent. I like the energy bar. I should be okay in the breeze here. Um, I'm taking zero wood. Okay, so nothing here. Actually, I might pick these up. But let's, uh... Whoa, let's split. Let's make like an atom, atom and split. Spent too much time up here already. And the wind's picking up, so let's, uh, let's get out of here. Back down the mountain. All right. The breeze is an issue because if I want to light a torch to scare the wolf, well, you know what? This is where the pistol comes in handy. Ha 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 ha. Now, I hope it's not going to jam on me, because, uh, well, that'll be a big problem. Um, no sense in trying to clean it now, but, you know, just for... Now I just have to remember to do it. At least, at least above 50%. I don't know where it's sitting right now, to be honest. Hold on a second, let me take a look. Because now, now I'm wondering. Uh, revolver, 51%. Okay, so I did repair it enough. So, in between episodes, I did a little bit repairing, and then I decided to read the Revolver book until it was too dark, so I kind of stopped there. So I guess the good news is uh, I did repair it enough. Yep, we're just going to carelessly come down the mountain. <laughs> We'll be fine. 
Uh, maybe. Well. Okay, well, maybe. I might have to... Can I... Come on, get me up here. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, okay. Come on, can I get up here? Come on, there we go. There we go, yay. Well, it looks like I'm gonna have to hop down here. Um... If I can swing it... Oh, shoot. <laughs> Too far. Hmm. All right, what clothes got? Uh, that's okay. Uh, but I got a sprain. You know what? I think I might be okay. <laughs> I mean, if anything, I'll just sleep it off. Unless Astrid starts complaining too much. <laughs> she has a sprained wrist, so we should be okay. Okay, so he's coming back over this way, but we're gonna tr try to avoid him, maybe. Yeah, I only... <laughs> yep, here he comes. Alright, I only needed to rest two hours, but, uh... So, let's try getting him. Alright, come here. I only need to hit him once. I mean, I could have killed him, but I really want to just save the bullets I have. So I got 28 and 5, so yeah, well, 5 now. Uh, and then 28 and 6 would make it 34, so, but so 33 now. Which ain't, which is not bad at all. Um, yeah, that's actually a pretty respectable amount. Um, I know I'll find a lot more. And, uh, yeah, we'll, uh, probably maybe sleep in the dam. Um, definitely inside the dam. As if anybody's watched my, uh, 500 series. If you know, you know. Yeah. So we'll, uh, we'll do that. Okay, no bear. Yeah, sorry you guys are gonna have to deal with the with the pain effects of the blurred vision and the the echo <laughs> or the uh, muffle yeah the muffle hearing from pain. Until we go to sleep. I should be fine. Yeah, see, if it was my ankle, then I probably would have dealt with it, but it's my wrist, so... And I can still use the gun, so I'm okay there. Now, if it's both wrists, then that's a different story. Because then you can't hold anything. The wind is picking up. Uh, it does make me wonder if, uh... The blizzard's coming. Well, before it gets too dark, should I hit up these trailers? Hmm. I already am carrying quite a bit, and if I'm trying to hit up Ash Canyon... Well... Nope. I don't want to hear your nonsense, sir. Oh my god. All right. Let's just go ahead and close this. You can't catch me! Ha 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 ha. Alright, let's put this away. Inside we go. Alright. I mean, do I just... I think I might... <laughs> I mean, it's going to be dark here soon anyway, so I might just... I'm just sleep for two hours, and that way I just heal up. Yep, okay. 
Huh. It's a little light in here, which is kind of odd. Whoa. Mm. These are cool. They're heavy. Very heavy. So I'm going to say no. <laughs> What am I carrying that's so heavy there, Astrid? All right. Charcoal and the lantern. Uh, a couple books. Mm, I'm carrying that. And if I get a moment, I might actually just read it. See, and, hmm. Okay. It's nothing too crazy. Okay, well, whatever. Um, like I said, I had to remember. Minimal looting here. So, minimal looting. Oh, give me the cash. Aw, nothing. Not even papers. But I am also looking for food, so, I mean... Eh, I I guess, but I'm gonna just, I'll probably go in and grab the toilet water, though. Wow, nothing in here. Whoops, back it up. How much water I got? One liter. Uh, let me grab. Oh my goodness, nothing in here. Okay, well, let's, uh, let's go, just go grab the water from here. We'll come back and properly loot this place. Uh, pry bar, I don't need it. I already have it. Um, okay, well, we'll take... That was kind of a pitiful amount, but whatever. How much is here? One seven. So let's take, like, a half a liter. I mean, that gives me two liters. You know, let's take it all. Why not? This is fine. I mean, we're going to drink it at some point. <laughs> It's not like it's going to just sit in my inventory forever. I'm hoping for a better hat. It's kind of... This will come in handy. Well, I'll take it because I'll have to tear it down, but uh, that's not what I was talking about. <laughs> that's not what I was talking about. All right. Okay, minimal. Now, over here, there might be some good stuff, maybe. Or not. Am I still in pain? Oh. I guess I am. That's odd. Okay, well, alright, we'll just take that then, right? Huh. Interesting. So, <laughs> sprained ankle, but I'm still in pain. Hope nobody needs this well, we'll take the line, but we're not really gonna need it. Okay, so there really wasn't much there. Yeah, minimal looting means just opening lockers with that need to be opened. Man, nothing. Oof. That's rough. Oh my god. So it makes me wonder if, holy crap. It makes me wonder if it's like, it's all going to be in one spot and I'm just going to get an over... over inundated with just loot. What do you got there, man? Painkillers? Eh, we'll probably take that from you. You ain't gonna need it. I'm kind of hoping I won't need it either, but I'm sure I will. I mean, it's it still kind of light out, which is interesting. I say, usually there's broken arrows in the door. And on this guy. Antiseptic. <laughs> Another marine flare. Very interesting. Um... I'm gonna go with, we'll leave that there. Um, probably bring it out later. Eh. 
There's never anything in there. Like, <laughs> I don't know why I look at it, but there's never anything in there. I don't know if anybody else has come across that where it's... If there's actually anything in there. I haven't. Okay, so we're not gonna go further than this room. So if anything, I'm going to... I haven't let this room relax. Well, this stuff will come in handy. Hmm. Well, I mean, I have that already. Is this sweater better? Oh my gosh, it is torn to hell. All right, whoop, let me, uh, let me, while I can see, because I don't want to be, it's, uh, this may or may not give me food poisoning. Okay. All right, so we'll drink the water. Really, we're going to have to... Well, let's try to sleep for 12, right? Um, who knows if it's is actually going to be... Now oh, it's still dark. Of course it's still dark. All right, so we're going to have to... We're going to pass time for a little while. Okay, and let's drink more water, <laughs> and then we'll sleep for a couple hours, right? This way, I'm fully rested, it's daylight, and we can continue, continue on our journey. That's fine, pick it up. Uh, to the door. Ah, morning. Where it's most, where it's coldest. <laughs> hmm. I am half wondering if I don't uh, try to just make my way over here. Ah. It's like kicking me out. I mean, I do kind of want to just survey this spot, right? And just to... Just to... Just to get it. So let's take a look here. Okay, I'm, I'm freezing, so... Alright, 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 that's fine. Okay, let me stop the burn. I'm pretty certain there's a dead deer over here. Yep, okay. This is fine. Oh, it's foggy now. That's why it got darker. Here we Let's not look down. That was smart. All right, we'll just go back across here. And we'll uh, make our way down. Again, we're gonna... We're gonna use the pistol for our deterrent. There is a cave in here that I do want to inspect. Um... Uh, because I have found a, a hunting rifle in there. Actually, it was one of the specialty rifles. I think it was Vaughn's rifle I found in there. Um, I don't know what the what's so special about each one. If, like, you know, your typical hunting rifle, if there's any difference between that and Barb's or Vaughn's or mm, whatever that third one is. I don't know. But at any rate. We'll see what we can find here. Because there is some good stuff in that cave. And if I find another book, sweet. It is helpful to find a lot of books. Because then... It's that much more experience points that you don't have to do said task to <laughs> increase your skills. Now, the one that I would really like to get is the uh, sewing book. Because sewing is going to be the biggest pain in the butt to level up. Always is. Let's see. 
Okay, there is a rabbit down here. Okay, there's the wolf. So let's uh, let's kind of uh, go over this way. Make sure that rabbit stays in between it and me. Eh, okay, he's fine. He's back that way. Okay, I feel my feet. You're fine. We will gather this up because it seems like I'm going to need <laughs> all the cattail sticks I can get at this point considering I'm having a very hard time finding any kind of food right now. Anyway, obviously when I start hunting, it'll be, I mean, it'll just come, you know, and you know, if I start harvesting some meat off a of deer, you know, that kind of thing, it'll, it'll just be easier. to remember where this cave is if it's I think it's up here I think it's up here what is down there um I didn't think there was any kind of a carcass there unless it's a dead guy well we'll find out but I did yeah this is the cave I want to check out yep 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 Like I said, if I find a rifle, I'll take it with me to a point. Probably at this stage, I'll probably take it to the farmhouse and drop it and leave it there. Um, it's a little too much to take. Okay, mm no rifle here, but there is a... Sweet. Use this. Ooh, this is for improves harvesting skill, which we will definitely read. But no rifle. Okay, that's fine. I kind of relieved I guess I mean I don't need okay it's nothing I don't really need uh the rifle right now because chances are I'll be able to see a bear um I don't know I mean it's I can always just run from it I guess and the fact that I don't carry anything that's going to be stinky and the path that I'm taking is going to be Yeah, there might be a bear in my way, but at least I kind of know where it is. It's just passing through Timberwolf Mountain. What is down here? Let's let's take a look at this before I head down that path. Let's take a look what's here, because I don't know. Oh, there's a guy. Just pff, plopping. Oof, that's rough, bro. Dude, did you get stabbed? Dude, this is like a murder scene. This will come in handy. Yeah, it will once I patch it up. Bro is stabbed. That that's not that's not a that's not a oh look I, I, I froze to death. No, dude got stabbed and left here. Hmm. Hmm. The plot thickens. I will probably never find out who did it. But it makes me want to watch my back. More than I already am. I was just thinking, you know, when you interact with a animal carcass, it deteriorates, you know, at the normal decay rate or whatever, and eventually goes away, like despawns. So the crows don't drop, excuse me, don't drop the feathers. Um, but a person, so I think you can farm the feathers from, from that. But there's plenty of carcasses that I don't touch, but then again, it's like I would probably rather have one that's close to a base if I were to do that so that I can always just go there for it. Alternatively, if I kill an animal close to a base, then I can just leave it there. It's a goddamn freezing. Yes. But we're going to go into this cave and it'll be all right.
Hang on a tick. Oh. Okay, so... I think there's a couple of spots up there that I... E hmm. Yeah, like up here. I know there's some spots up there. I think there's two locations up that way. I am rather curious. Uh, well, there's one. What's the other one? I don't know, to be honest. I don't think that cave was a spot. Maybe it's something that has to do like with the dam. Uh, I don't know. We'll figure it out when we come back, I guess. I mean, we have 700 days to figure that out. Actually, 758. Or 750 at this point, something like that. I don't know what day we're on. Day 8, so 750. Okay, did I pass anything up? I'm just, like, wandering aimlessly. Coal or stone? Stone, stone, stone. We'll probably, oh, uh, well, I mean, it's midday. I just want to warm up in here, right? Should be like a campsite of some kind. That's a, that. Uh, but I thought there was a person with some stuff. I thought there was a person. Person with some stuff. Dead end somewhere where there's some stuff. <laughs> I'm looking for some stuff. We'll head up, uh, once we get out of here, we'll head up to the, uh, signal tower. Mm. Is this the other way, or is this going back the way I came? I mean... Uh, no, this is not back the way I came. There it is. This is what I was kind of looking for. Not what I expected it to look like, but it is what it is. I need some food in the belly. What you got, sir? You have nothing, sir. Um, do I take the coal? Let's take the coal. Because at least there I can... burn it. I took the extra bedroll because if it's better than the one I have, I didn't check it. But if it's better than the one I have, then we'll... you know, we'll... Uh, Chop it up, tear it up, yeah, tear it up. Okay, I already came down this way. This is the way back. I need to go up and around. I guess all this wandering around in here isn't so bad because it's giving me more of an opportunity to warm up, which I'm all for. I don't think there's a deer carcass in here. Not in this cave. Yeah, I wanted to check out down here. In some of these cave systems, it's, I kind of forget what what's where. And hey, all right, so I stand corrected. There is a deer carcass down here, which isn't such a bad thing. Um, I may do this. I may. Um, let's actually. Let's actually do this. Um, okay, to put you away. Because 
Yeah, I want to. <laughs> I want to start a fire. I want to cut them up. I want to cook it. Um. Might even leave the guts in here, but I want the meat, and I'll probably cheese the harvesting. Or no, I won't. Hmm. I might cheese the harvesting. Ugh. Well, we got plenty of that, so let's do that. Okay. Ooh, not a lot of meat on this thing. Okay, well, that's all we're gonna get out of it then. Um, let's take both the guts. Okay. Yeah, there wasn't a lot of meat on that deer. Hmm. All right. Do, 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 the way to the end. Yeah, this will help with the hunger and the thirst. Um, the hunger is what I want to keep up. I'm still, I'm like, usually by now I have the well fed, but I have let my hunger go all the way down. And, you know, I don't know what day I'm on with uh, keeping food in my belly. So, uh, well, <laughs> kind of hoping to, let's just drink this. Once I start hunting things, it won't be so bad. Um, the abundance of meat will be easier to come by. So uh, we'll just have this. Okay, that's fine. I only need the one. Uh, let's see, did I wanna cook something up here? Probably. I think I want to place... Whoops, jeez. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Sorry, guys. That whipped around further. Nope, not heat up. I should have had another birch bark. Okay, yeah, I do. Let's cook this. This way I have all the birch bark I need. It still gives you the the benefits, even if it's not hot. Um, though, if I have it at my disposal to get the warm-up buff, too, then I'll take it. But we're not going to... Uh, hold on. Okay, let's see the cans. Still have two cans. So we'll actually, uh, we'll take it because. Eat it. Alright. This should be fine. So we can actually save the lamp, the lamp fuel too. I mean, at least for now, until this thing goes out, it wasn't a very good torch. Uh, but, you know, well, it is what it is. I didn't expect it to last. I kind of don't need it to last. And if anything, if it goes out, then I'll just, you know. And nothing in here. Okay. I don't know if there ever is. Uh, midday. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't forget to drop... <laughs> to drop the guts. Because <laughs> I get attacked and I'll be like, why did it come after me so relentlessly? Oh, that's right, because I'm carrying guts. I mean, I could take it with me. It's not a huge deal, but I would rather not draw attention to myself, I guess. If I have the choice. If I can see the exit. All right. Yay. Um, yes. We're going to drop both of those. Um, now that I'm thinking about it, now I'm thinking about it, should I just take it with me? I mean... No, nah. I'll, I'll forever have guts. But, while I'm thinking about it, I might put in a note that's, uh... ML to... PV... Cave... Um... Two guts. 
I probably should have uh, done that from the start. Is it, am I going to be able to see? Yep. All right. Cool. I'm not going to get terribly crazy with uh, mapping right yet, but, you know, if I think about it, because I know I'm probably going to be back through these areas quite a bit. 758 days is a lot. I actually half thought we would have been to Ash Canyon by now, but uh, due to certain things um, completely within my control, uh, we have not. <laughs> ah, looks like a blizzard's rolling in. Fantastic. Mmm. Well, I know there's a cave up here. And I might stop in there, but I'm gonna have to light a fire and keep it lit because it's not exactly warm. Um, I know I've damn near froze to death in that cave where there's a blizzard outside. You know, I light a fire and I'm like, oh, I'll be fine inside my blanket. And no, I was not fine inside my blanket. <laughs> I was freezing. Now, of course, if I make it to Signal Hill, that's that's one thing, but uh, it looks like it's uh, gets pretty cold pretty fast here, so we'll just uh, we'll speed walk. Since I'm carrying some heavy things, I'm not sure what. I think my clothes are probably what's doing it. I mean, maybe, I, maybe I'll make it to... Well, I mean, when there's a blizzard, I'm not going to come across any any predators. This is true. But, uh, I mean, there's the trade-off of my clothes get ripped up, and which I guess isn't all that bad, considering I need to mend as much as possible. Uh, it'll probably be, like, one of the last things I have level 5, but... I'm just trying to see where this cave is. Pretty certain there's like a dead guy in front of it. I would be correct, because it's right here. Sometimes he has a hatchet. I'm like laying next to him, but he does not this time. Nor does he have a knife sticking out of his back. Yeah, see it's still I'm still cold in here. Um Ooh, nice. I will take. Oh, it is, I am warmed up in here. All right, well, that's, that's fine. Because I'm deeper in the cave, I guess. All right, all right, all right. Well, let's, uh, well, we'll just stick in here for a minute and warm up slowly. Um, I think what I'll end up doing here is, well, let's, uh, patch up our clothes. This bag is getting too heavy to carry. At least until I can see that, uh, Oh, it failed? Or, oh, my goodness. <sighs> oh, my goodness. Don't fail. There you go. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah. Um, I want to repair this. Because I want to wear it. Don't fail. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna like run out of this thing and I'm gonna have to make like fishing line. Cool. Now, is this warmer than that? Well, of course it is. But by how much? 2, 1, 32. That guy who drank his own pee doesn't seem so crazy right now. Ah. That does. Hey, there's the well-fed. Excellent. Stop talking about drinking pee. That's gross. Okay. Now, I think what we can do maybe is... Well, let's harvest this because we surely don't need that. Actually, probably the other one, too. I think I'm out of cloth. Whoops. Uh, yeah, so let's harvest this one, too. 
You're not that tired, girl. <laughs> Remarkable. I still have... 70s. I mean, I can try to patch some of this stuff up, especially these 70-somethings. 60 64, 63. Sure, why not? Okay. Can't patch those up. Ooh, I didn't realize I had thermals on. Or didn't have thermals on. I have thermals. Awesome. Okay, let's come in and harvest this stuff. Now nah, we're gonna kinda do some stuff here. I may take off. I'm waiting for the storm to be done. But I know blizzards can last upwards of like 12 hours or something like that. It's it's kind of ridiculous at how long they can last. I can still hear it blowing. So we may be having to wait a little bit longer. Hmm, looks like it's just windy. Okay, so the blizzard's over, but it's just windy. We'll make it to Signal Hill, I think. Yeah, why don't we go to Signal Hill and we'll camp there for the night. Uh, yeah, it's like I'm cold, but or I'm getting cold, but it's not not terrible. Why is there a wolf over here? Where... Is that him? Yep, that's him. I need to get him on flat ground here. Come at me, bro. Okay, reload. He'll be back. I mean, to be fair, it's getting dark, <laughs> so. Hey, look, there he is again. Come here, homie. You know what, you're, I'm gonna see if I can't get you, come here. Whoa, okay, well I hit him. He'll die. And let's use this antiseptic just so we're we're getting rid of the heavier things. Okay. Well <laughs> Yeah, that, that wolf will be dead. Cause not only did I shoot him, but I Whacked him with a hatchet, so I'm actually kind of surprised he didn't just die in instantly right there. I'm actually kind of astonished he's kept coming. I'm not carrying any meat, am I? No, because I dropped the guts. And I cooked the meat that I got off that deer and I ate it. I don't know. I don't know what the difference was this time. But, uh, I, I... I'm sure if I went go looking for him, I'm confident I will find it. But not that I'm going to go, you know, cook him up or anything and eat him because I really don't want the parasites. I've seen what it does. Like, you have to... Ugh, nope. I'm good. Because you can't even research. Like, I have all these books. I wouldn't be able to research for, like, 20 days or... And no. Like, no, no, no. We're just... No. Yeah. There are plenty of other things to eat. <laughs> I don't need... I don't need that... I don't need that in my life. Oh, over here. Okay. <laughs> I was like, I'm getting close. I thought I was at the top of the hill here. That's right over here. Okay, cool, cool, cool.
That's a land. <laughs> no, okay. That's <laughs> not the way I want to go. That's. Jeez. This way. There it is. Okay, cool. I don't think I've uh, had an Aurora yet. This. I don't think so. Signal Hill. We'll probably grab the loot from up here and take it down to the farmhouse. Um, you know, maybe that's what I do in each region is pretty much try to centralize. I mean, I'm really just going to Ash Canyon, but when I really start looting places, I'll just centralize um, stuff. There usually is a pry bar sitting underneath the... Uh, but And wood is here, but we don't really have time to light a fire here, so we're not going to. Okay. Aha! There's the distress flare. Cool. And matches. I was kind of missing that. And had few matches in a while. I don't know how I was doing on those, by the way. Decent combat pants. Hmm. Decent combat pants. I mean, okay. <laughs> I yeah, we'll still take them with me. I it's not. Yeah, you know, the snow pants are better, but. Uh, Ooh, emergency stem. Uh, yeah, that'll come in handy. Um, let's move this down. Mm, actually, you know what? Let's uh, let's leave that and put it out. To be honest. Yeah. There we go. Okay, cool. This is in better condition. I I I keep getting the sneaky suspicion that the uh, low conditioned uh, lanterns burn fuel faster. Now, don't don't quote me on that, but I feel like it is. Oh, cool. I'll need to read that. Excellent. These are some good things here. Military coat. I'll take it, but I'm going to rip it up because, yikes. Nope, don't need the combat boots. Take the sewing kit. Yes. Flare. Rip it up. I'll probably sit up here and do all that. More bullets. Don't need the ski gloves, but we'll rip it up. Barely walk with this much gear. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll be fine. Flare shell. Cool. Yeah, this is just good to just grab what I can from up here. Um, we'll take it down to the farmhouse. I'm um, debating whether I want to make it down there tonight or wait for morning. Well, this stuff will come in handy. Revolver ammo, which is great. More revolver ammo. Oh my gosh. I would hit level 5 on this thing in no time. Just leave the newspaper. I don't care. Okay. It's dark, and I think it's probably best if I just, uh, ah, forgot that. Didn't see that. Well, <laughs> it's a good thing there's nothing in there, but still. Okay. Well, let's turn this light off. And put it away. Why don't we do this? While I'm thinking about it, we'll load this up because I know it's like I'll go to need it and it will be one of those things where uh, I won't realize that uh, I didn't load it until I go to fire it. And I'm like, why won't this shoot? Oh, that's right. Because I forgot to load it. Okay. Mm, bed. 
Hopefully this actually lets me sleep until daylight, so I'm not waking up in the middle of the night like I have been. Oh, got rested. Okay. Oh, okay. That's daylight. That's fine. Uh, I'm half thinking I might want to... I need to find food. Well, geez. I'm gonna rip this up right now. <laughs> right now. Okay. Let's drink this water. We'll eat some food. Uh... Jeez Louise, okay. This is part of my problem. Is I picked up all this stuff and I need to harvest it. I can't be walking around with it. I know, I know, I know. We're gonna eat. Um, let's do this. Let's drink this. So that'll help. Mm, like that. Okay. Should I just go ahead and read all five? Why not? Anything right now. Okay. Where am I on that, by the way? Oh, okay, so I'm pretty darn close. All right, well, let's head down um, to the farmhouse. Uh, looks like it's going to be a little bit on the uh, foggy side. I need to keep that well-fed buff going. So, actually, while I'm thinking about it, because... Okay, this should be fine. All right, I, uh, yeah. <laughs> so once I get to the farmhouse, then, um, well, I think, I guess we'll loot that, but then we'll be able to take stock, drop stuff, things like that, um, to keep on going. Uh, when I hit Timberwolf Mountain, we're not going to go to the summit yet. Um, I may hit it on the way back. Uh, the reason I say on the way back, because it's a lot easier to do it that way, and I can pretty much haul stuff down. Um, I can use the uh, Mountaineer's Cabin as kind of a, I guess more or less of a base where I can kind of bring stuff down and go back up and bring stuff down and go back up, you know, that kind of deal. I guess what I could also do is... When I come back, and I'm just kind of spitballing here, is when I come back from Ash Canyon, well, it's easier just to hit the summit from where I am instead of coming all the way back to the Mountaineer's Cabin. I was thinking, uh, unless, of course, I, because there's a rope that sits by the Mountaineer's Cabin, and we'll kind of talk about that when I get to it. Um, but taking that with me and then dropping it so that I can tie it off, you know, it'll save me a trip. Take me a few trips from going all the way around. But we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Uh, for now, we're just going to hit up the farmhouse. Now, when we hit the farmhouse, we're going to loot it. We're going to kind of set up a base there, drop some stuff, kind of get myself situated on uh, our next adventure out uh, through uh, Timberwolf Mountain. Um, and then hit Ash Canyon and make our way up. Yep, uh, it's a good thing I have all this coffee because I will definitely need it for the climb up. Um, that's one of those regions where you do not want to underestimate it. Um, just for the sheer amount of climbing that you have to do, it's very, very easy to get exhausted. I may even, and I know I can get the crampons there, but I may even try to uh, make some improvised ones beforehand which may not be a bad idea. I just need to find some s more scrap metal. Uh, not out of the question, because I'm pretty sure there's some... I'm, I'm sure I can find some. Uh, at least that'll help me with climbing around out there until I can get the, the, the good crampons <laughs> from, the, from the gold mine, along with the technical backpack. 
So, I'm thinking way ahead, but for now, we're just heading down to the farmhouse. I'm probably eating something while I'm on my way. Like, I need to... Man, it's like, I can't keep my food stores up. I'm... It's a little rough. It probably won't be quite nightfall by the time I get to the farmhouse, which will give me time to read, maybe. Maybe a fire starting book or a field dressing book. Yeah, probably because I could start reading that thing because I need to read that for 10 hours. Um, it really depends. Like if there's a, if I can get enough food to last me for, you know, a good day's worth and then I can... Yeah, if I can get a day's worth of food, and if there's a blizzard that is going to prevent me from going anywhere, then I can spend a day reading, and I should be okay. Um, debating whether I want to look in the outbuildings, because sometimes there's some good stuff in the barn out there. I think there might be another book. Um, I, don't get me wrong, I have been getting really good luck with, with finding books. Uh, I mean, hell, it's like, yeah, Forlorn Muskeg expenses. Farmhouse, I found three books right there in that, right there next to the forge, which is unheard of. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever, I've never experienced it, and I don't think anybody else, uh, if I've ever seen anybody else come across three books in, in one location like that. Yeah, there's wolves out there in the orchard, so we're gonna just kind of go around and just go down the road. Uh, as long as there's no bear, because the bear does wander down this way. We'll just, uh, we'll make sure. Okay, so far so good. Usually he stays on that road, which is interesting. So, I mean, he won't, when he does his little wandering, he usually stays down that road. He doesn't really come up here towards this barn, which is kind of odd, but I mean, you know, it's, it is what it is. Let's put the gun away because I have a tendency to accidentally discharge. Okay. Uh, what we got? Oh, wool mitts. That's always nice. A stump remover. We'll need to take that with us back to... Um, is that a sock? No, it's not. Wait, what's this? Oh, wait, that's what it is. <laughs> I knew there was two there. <clears throat> Wood. We'll probably take it with... A Ooh, a flare. I think I can use this. Okay, okay. Oh. I guess I knew that was there, but, uh, you know, I'll take that with us. <clears throat> I'm not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. Well, we know. Ha <laughs> ha Oh, yeah. I guess, uh, yeah, if I do come across a bear and he's coming at me, then, well, I have my flare gun. But I don't think he is. And I see a couple of wolves out there, but we're heading straight uh, this away. Yep, I'm carrying too much, but it's probably because of those logs I picked up. Which is fine, I'm going to drop them in the farmhouse here, so we're good. Uh, yeah, a little foggy. Eh, it's getting later in the afternoon. I don't have to worry about the cold. Really, the only thing I'm worrying about is my hunger. <laughs> Go figure. Really, anything I come across, I'm probably just going to eat it. Hmm. Okay. It's 
So what I can always do, if I decide I'm kind of taking too much, see, I don't want to map this if uh, something comes wandering around. Yeah, if something comes wandering around, I don't want to be mapping something because they will pretty much attack right away. Ooh, let's check this out first while I'm while I'm at it. Before we go in the house. Because sometimes there's some things in here. Mm, I think. Sometimes. Whoop. Like, not spray paint. I don't... <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, I like spray paint, but I don't need to spray paint. Okay, crows are going that way. Yep, let's hit up the farmhouse. It should still be some. Somewhat light in there. And... Sometimes there's dog food in here. Doesn't appear to be this time. Porch. Ah, jerry can. All right. Yep, we'll take it inside. Um, obviously. Ooh, I need to eat. Where's the food? Just something. Okay, so here we are. Ooh, a carrot. Can I eat it? I can eat the carrot. Sweet. We're just gonna eat a bunch on the carrot. Eh, cause I'm not too keen on making those kinds of recipes yet, and uh, it's just easier to go about it like that so all right so let's drop the cedar wood because there's a crap ton I am carrying and let's bounce over here and we'll drop the coal drop all of it um oh yeah Drop this so I can. Uh, let's put the jerry can up here. That'll be fine. Ah, a pot. I left both pots out there. Oh, man. Well, that's okay. That's okay. Crackers. Eat the crackers. Okay. Wood matches. Excellent. Okay. That's, that's uh, great, I guess. Um, search the cabinets. So what we're really looking for is food up in this piece. I wonder if I can eat the potato straight up. I don't know how I'd feel about eating a raw potato. This is handy. Just saying. Can I? Nope. Okay. I didn't think so. I, I don't know how good eating a raw potato would be anyway. Ugh. I don't know, some people will be like, it's not that bad. Uh, yeah, well, I'll pass. I know I probably tried doing it when I was a kid, just like, oh, what's a raw potato taste like? Ha ha ha. And it turned out to not be what I thought. So in kit, fantastic. We'll take it all. Oh, just a book, okay. <laughs> I'm like, oh man, all right, all right, all right. Mm, candy bar and orange soda. Cloth, always good. Um, probably just take, you know what? This pack is getting too heavy to carry. I know, I know. We're we're dropping, we're going back here. This is easier to do it this way than trying to. Do it like. Oh, one's fur, one cedar. Okay, well. I did leave quite a bit back at the Mystery Lake. Ah, mag lens. Perfect. I will definitely need that. We'll start ripping up some clothes. Maybe we can find some. Okay. 
any little piece of food that I can pick up that's, you know, easy to eat on the go kind of thing is going to be helpful. Um, that way I'm, man, a lot of, a lot of, uh, sewing kits, which is good. I mean, nothing worse than not having a sewing kit when you need it. And you're like, oh, I'll just patch up some clothes. No, you won't. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. And then we'll head downstairs and see what else we can find. Wow. Okay. So shelf, reclaim wood. That's fine. What's there? Candy bar. Excellent. Okay. Next room. I can barely walk with this much gear. Astrid, come on, girl. We're 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 doing all right. We you know we know you're encumbered a little bit. Antibiotics. That'll be nice. Might as well take this water. Ah, well, I need some, like, climber socks is what I really need. Or another set of, ooh, a ski jacket. I wonder if I can, I mean, I know it's not as warm. Hmm. But it's lighter. Like, how much, how much, let's see, you got one, 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 33. Jeez, it's like, okay, so it's double the protection, but it's also, hmm, I, you know, for the sake of mobility, I may just throw that on. I don't know if that's a wise decision or not. The funny thing is with this, Well, that windbreaker really does protect me from the wet. I'm just trying to, let's just do that, just for the sake of. Hmm. Ah. Well, okay, so we'll, okay, we'll keep that the way it is, and if it becomes too much of a problem, well, I mean, I, I guess I just have to make an executive decision on which one I want to keep. I may, I may hang on to that coat and put it somewhere. Um, obviously, if I'm going to freeze, I'm going to freeze. I mean, I've had that park on and been in a blizzard, and it's been cold enough to just freeze me regardless. So uh, I think for the sake of mobility, ah, I need the scrap metal for sure. Uh, I think for the sake of mobility, I think I'll just have the ski jacket and we'll drop the parka. Uh, we'll probably drop it downstairs, though. It's empty. Okay. And if I find a hockey jersey, we'll patch that up because I know the hockey jersey is actually surprisingly warm. I, <laughs> I you know, I always thought, I was like, ah, jersey, how, how warm could that be? Uh, it's very warm, actually. Okay, table, don't need to really do anything with that. I'm not. Mm, okay. But we need to patch up that jersey, which isn't a big deal. Okay, so let's go downstairs. Like all the way downstairs. <laughs> yes. I think there's a hammer right... Oh, there's a pry bar right there. Usually there's a hammer somewhere close. Okay, so we have that. I need to see what... Uh, I need to be at a workbench, I think, in order... Nope, no potatoes. Mm. Running river roads, we'll take it upstairs. Hmm... No. Yeah, we'll take it upstairs to that... Uh, the uh, medicine cabinet upstairs. Um, but I probably will drop the other antiseptic. Um, yeah, we need all the metal. Let's see. I think, 
let's see here. The uh, improvised crampons. So I need one more scrap metal. Oh, two leather and a workbench. Okay. So I need one more scrap metal, which shouldn't be terribly hard to find. If anything, I can cut up a metal shelf or something. Maybe. I mean, I have a hacksaw. But I'm hoping I can find a scrap metal later. Well, this stuff will come in handy. Ah, well, okay. We'll take it upstairs. Um, we're going to eat the carrot. Oh, I probably should have left the potato. Because I can eat the carrots. Damn it. I took some potatoes. Drop the potatoes. I don't want them. Drop, drop. Okay. <laughs> I really don't want the potatoes. And the... Oh, a fishing book. Awesome. Stacy's grape soda. Perfect. Cured leather. I can make my crampons. Uh, but the question is, am I going to have enough light in order to do it? Because I kind of want to not have my lantern lit. So, let's, uh, well, let's do this. So, um, let's just, it takes four hours, so let's see. We'll do it as long as it'll let me. I got halfway there. Let's put that away. I may actually sleep down here, but let's uh let's eat this carrot first. And that carrot. <laughs> and that carrot. All right, and then we're going to drink the agua. And while we're at it, let's tear that up. Yeah, we'll just sleep down here. That way we can get up in the morning and make our the rest of our crampons. I know I'm gonna wake up in the middle of the night. I mean, I'm not that tired. I really haven't been exerting myself. Oh, okay. Well, um, let's uh, do what, like two hours maybe? Um, okay, let's see what that did. Drink this water because I have a lot of it. Improvise crampons. Let's just do it the rest of the way. Okay, well, fine. Cool. There, now that will give me that sure footing. And uh, so it does two things. Uh, the first thing it does is that it allows you to climb ropes a lot better. Um, without tiring out so fast. And the other thing is, is that it, anytime you're on a sloped uh, hill, you know, incline, whatever, you, it decreases your chances of getting a sprain. So that's nice. Uh, let's turn this off. I think I can see just fine. Just making our way up back upstairs. Um, where we'll drop some stuff. I think I can see the outline of the stairs. There we are. Okay. <laughs> yep. Okay. All right. Back into the kitchen where... Oh, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to drop off uh, all of that and all of that and all of that. Yikes. I'm going to drop off all of that. Mmm... I think that's okay. We're fine there. Okay. Um, let's bounce over here and we'll drop the heavy A close and drop that. We're going to patch this up. That's what we want to do. We wanted to patch this up. 
If I can patch anything up, that is. Jeez. Oh my goodness. This is probably the more frustrating thing to do. It's it's like, okay, so... Oh, I've never been so hungry in my life. Yeah. Like, this is tedious. This probably is the most tedious part of the, of the whole game. And that takes care of that. All right, so with that, is the jersey more... It is. See, look, that's... But is the hoodie better than the jersey? No, actually, the hoodie's better. The jersey's better than the hoodie. Okay. So we have that. Um, we're going to come here to the clothes. We're going to probably... We're going to drop this thing because... Yeah. Because it's heavy. Um, am I wearing those gloves? Eh, we could probably... I'm already moving faster. Um, let's drink some water. All right. Um, I think that's, uh, we're going to put a cut in here. Um, I think what I'll do, what I'm going to do in the meantime in between is uh, get myself squared up, probably patch up some clothes, you know, rearrange my uh, inventory here, um, eat something like a carrot. And before I take off towards uh, Timberwolf Mountain, um, just to make sure I have everything that I need and that I'm not taking anything that I don't need. So uh, on the next one, we'll be passing through Timberwolf Mountain and probably uh, getting to Ash Canyon to get that technical backpack that we wanted. <laughs> and uh, we'll go from there. Thanks for joining me on this one, folks. Hope to see you on the next one of Survival 758. Remember to hit that like and subscribe, and I will see you on the next one. Adios.